everybody, we've just landed in Sydney, heading up to the Northern Beaches. Sadly, our next inductee is no longer with us, but today we get to meet his son and give them a great surprise. Okay, so I reckon we'll go out into the courtyard, we'll have an interview with him over on one of the coffee things. Yep, then you good. hide in the bushes. Bryony, our trusty bring in cameraman, is going to get you sneaking up and, and I'll do a bit of a stretch. Yep, that'll be your cue to come in. That's the signal, the stretch. The stretch. The stretch. The stretch. Let's do it. The first time I went to the speedway, I went to Westmead in uh, May 1965. I was playing in the mud, walking around behind the buildings, sliding down banks and stuff, and Dad come at an interval and said, make sure you watch the feature race. You go up to the grandstand and watch the feature race. Yeah. And make sure you watch Johnny Stewart and Jeff Freeman. Really? So I went up and I loved it. And Can I was I lucky enough. Can I just interrupt enough. you for a sec? Yeah. I'm not actually going to be doing an interview with you today at all. You're not? No. Because I've got somebody for you to meet here, Darren Tindall. <laughs> How are you, Wayne? Good, good. It is my absolute pleasure to let you know that this year we'll be honouring your dad oh, cool. at the 2023 Australian Speedway Hall of Fame. He actually died two weeks after his last meeting, okay. which was the 360 title in 2009. Yep. And his doctor told him not to go, and he said, I'm going. <laughs> and when he come back, the doctor said, that's it, no more, you can't do it. Okay. And he died two weeks later. Oh. So that's what, that's what Dad thought of Speedway, you know? Yeah. I'm really proud of Dad, what he did. Yeah. Mm. 